Good morning and welcome to a new studio vlog. Thank you so much for the love on the last vlog. Today it's the 28th of April, it is a Tuesday and I am going to get cracking with some of the orders that have come in. and say a massive thank you to two new patrons that have joined our community section this month and that is Katie May and Nicole so thank you thank you so much whilst everything loads on the computer I'm just going to do the names for this order just currently restarting my computer because it has decided not to work. I'm going to go ahead and work on some of the stickers whilst that updates itself. So I'll show you what I did earlier. Here's what I designed yesterday and I will insert that footage of how I got to this point. For the lettering I open Procreate and write out my word and then add a few illustrations to finish it off. I then save this as a PNG file and drag and drop it into the Silhouette Studio. I then trace the lettering and then offset my trace outline to give me my sticker cut line. I then simplify the notes so the machine has less points to read, making it quicker to cut. I finally turn on my print alignment settings and size accordingly.
like now on my computer. I'm just going to go ahead and click print it a few times and see what we get. I'm just using some sticker paper that I'd already got for my shipping labels for this. quickly foiled them I'm going to just pop them onto a silhouette cutting mat. Next job is to vectorize the bridal hanger order ready for laser engraving.
Okay, so the next bit, I don't know whether to do mirror for the inside, for the bit that's gonna be this bit. So I don't know whether to do mirror or whether to try pink. So I'm gonna do a bit of both now. Sublimation printing and some vinyl pressing, as well as doing some laser engraving if I get round to it. the back of these just so I can see where I'm lining it up on the mugs
This is the mugs all done and finished. Just wait for them to cool down before I can begin packing them. Now it's time to pack this morning's work. two kilos I'm going to be sending it via a courier and for that I do a search with parcels to go they are a price comparison website for parcels so you input your dimensions and the weight and then it gives you a list of options whether you want priority shipping three day and that can also be done for international as well I will show you now and I'm going to arrange that and get it dropped off I'm going to want to type in parcel to go you'll want to go in and put your information so my parcel was 2.6 kilo and then put your dimensions here are the different options so we've got a next day 
with the different couriers, UPS, DHL, DX, Parcel Force, and then into two day delivery and three day delivery. So I don't tend to use HAMS, but I like to use UPS or DPD. So I'm gonna go in with this one and I'm going to begin filling in the details. postage off at the post office and I'm going to head home. 